Well, hello there, Sarcastic Raptor. Welcome to the Frontline Chaos mod. This is only a really early version, so this is going to be more of a showcase rather than an actual full, like, how do I word it, not mod review or anything, because it's not finished yet, and it would be very dickish to just go out there and be like, oh, this isn't finished, blah, 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 blah. So there are, like, maps that you could like, get with the mod. I've got a load of weird maps, but I'm just going to maybe use the general zero-hour maps as for this, because I just want to make sure the AI is functioning. I think it's actually fine. I'm pretty sure they've got to be on easy. And there's only two factions, Revenant and the Legion at the moment. And we'll play against Revenant on easy. And we'll just play... Hmm, don't know what map, actually. Will this work? For example... Uh... We'll try this, but it might not work. It might just say uh, you've been victorious. Possibly. To zone. Oh, it looks like it's working. So our reach, this is the Revenant faction. The resources we get, I believe, is called... Oh, it's Listen's Plant. Lighten's Plant, Listen's Plant. And as you can see, it's still not finished yet, this mod. But it looks very promising. We have got custom... Textures and whatnot. Let's get a say supply depot. And some of the models are extremely good. I'm very impressed so far. Like the little detail on this is really good. Little turbines going round and round, trying their best. And one thing you might notice that one we don't have raid on too, there's actually fog of war, which makes it quite interesting. So I'm gonna get some warriors, which are basic infantry. Uh can Let's just grab a few leads. And we've got miners as well. Let's get a sentry gun just to guard that. I'm going to send these infantry out for a little scout. Let's build a few more as well. War factory as well. But yeah, this is Frontline Chaos mod and it does look like it is going to be a mod definitely to keep an eye on down the line. Always up for playing new mods. Let's get some Vanguard infantry. Let's get an RBG turret here. And yes, we can build Pandoras, which are all-terrain fighting vehicles for transport abilities. And we've got a few other vehicles here. This faction is definitely more complete than the other one we've got, which is the Legion. But it's still really impressive. Certainly a change of pace, I think, all these new factions. Because most mods just, like, reskin the current factions. There's not a lot of mods that actually just go out there and go, bang, okay, we're just going to do this. This one certainly does. So there's a sentry thing here. Do I find it's done that off the map? Is that going to work? I don't know. Construction complete. We will defend this territory. Construction also, they are playing. There we go. What do you need, Commander? Well, it means we're definitely going to want to keep building defences and just make sure the base is secure. We will a Goshawk or a Gustav, which is a bomber jet. Let's get a Goshawk. Which I believe is a bird of prey. Construction complete. And we can get the Duke or Duchess. As the, at the moment on the War Factory, I believe the Duchess is not available. We're obviously going to go for the Duke. Ooh. We are being attacked, so let's grab that. Unit Lost. 
as they do appear to be attacking this area, let's just send more units there. Ooh, they're coming from the north now. We can build a missile silo, which we will start getting. All this goodness. That is a constant stream of enemies. The AI is actually pretty not not bad. AI is actually pretty not bad, I just realised how bad English that was. Right, we've got no general powers to speak of at the moment. So, how good is my... Let's just launch our nuke and see what that does to him. Oh god. I can fire it again. Oh wow. Well, that's going to at least keep the enemy at bay for a little bit while I just say uh, I build up a fighting force. They realise I could just nuke them at uh, will essentially. We will start building some other units as well just to show you. Transport helicopters as well. We are building a Duke, which is one of our more heavily, our bigger, badder units. That's one another war factory there, quite badly. If he goes, and we can get fire 420 million gun and overload for him. Unit called a Reaper Commando and some incinerators. Let's just get a mix of everything. Is that airfield full? So, if you guys got. I know I've got machine guns. That's useful at least. Reaper Commando as well, still building even more units. So you can only build one joke. Oh, 
I think we'll start motoring, motoring on in there now, just to attack them. It's the... Am I right in thinking? Wait, wait, wait. Just stop moving you. You look a lot like a uh, Chimera. Uh, Imperial Guard Chimera. But I know a lot of units in Zero Hour are based off... Uh, well, uh, mods at least. They base them off like... Warhammer units. Looking at my points because we can't spend any of it anyway. As in case this does go badly, we will build more things. So you can see our Venom units as well. Our medics actually go around holding a briefcase. Overall, this does look like a promising mod. Destroy that, please. So, in the next video, we'll be playing as the Legion and just seeing what they're all about in terms of units and whatnot. So, I have to play playing against the same level AI because only easy AI is working at the moment. And I might just experiment on a few maps and see what we've got because I want to try and get this mod out there a bit more so people don't have an interest in it. Also, that hopefully will inspire the mod developers even further. But yeah, it's a really, really good mod. Check it out on ModDB. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time.